Warning. Viewer discretion is advised. This channel and its content are not intended for anyone under 13 years of age. If you are under 13, please turn off this video. The following may contain material not suited for viewers under 13, such as coarse and suggestive language, tobacco, drug, and or alcohol references, simulated slash fantasy violence, and adult situations. Additionally, this channel and its contents are not intended to be a replacement for proper parenting. Don't allow viewing habits to interfere with personal responsibilities and relationships. Constructive criticism is encouraged, making for better content. Jokes are jokes, albeit immature ones. Please watch responsibly. Thank you. It's personal. It's stupendous. It's conspicuously incredible. Hurry, hurry, step right up. Hey, Sonny, you want to give it a try? Hello, everyone, and welcome back to another edition of Conspicuously Incredible Gaming. I am your host, Mike. So this is going to be... Nine? Number nine of, uh... Wizards and Warriors 3, Kuros Visions of Power. This one's kind of, I mean, I'm. this is the way I'm kind of figuring it out, is that at least this one's kind of going to be the cleanup. You know, maybe picking apart a few things, and then, like, the last one, the next one after this, should be the finale. That's the way I'm imagining it in my head. But, you know, again, we will see. But I've got all three of the jobs and their highest guilds, so i got to find that one last jewel and that one last goofy chick that wants to marry me, and then i got to maybe might try to sift around and find some uh, hidden spots and stuff that I wasn't able to get to because of the jobs and the abilities. But this is probably going to be the cleanup, and the next one's probably going to be the end. So let's get on right into it. And as I mentioned in the Discord, it's between the last one and this one, that I'm stuck here on I-80, close to Salt Lake City, about 60, 70, well, about 70-ish miles, 65, 70-ish miles from the Wyoming-Utah border. And I, I, I had to stop, I mean, well... Luckily, I stopped when I did last night because they were talking, when you get on Google Maps and you look at the place that you're supposed to be dropping at and the other drivers leave comments and, and suggestions and, you know, reviews, oh, they'll only let you in 15 minutes before your appointment time. So I'm like, well, damn, the way I'm tracking, I'm going to be a whole hour, hour and 15 minutes early. So let me go ahead and take a break. I can go back in the back and grab something to eat and you know whatever the hell I also got to do and then take off in about 45 minutes or so, kind of stretch it out and then get over there. Well, as soon as I stopped and I went and double checked and because the roads were already starting to get bad when I stopped and, and it's not a truck stop. This is just a, a parking spot off the side of the road with, I don't know, Maybe 20 parking spots for, you know, maybe not even 20 parking spots. There might be a garbage can out here or a dumpster. There might be, but I don't even think there's a shitter out here. So, if I got to shit, I'm going to shit in a bag. Got to do what you got to do, right? <laughs> Toss it out on the, try to, try to make it in the back of those salt trucks. <laughs> that way they can spread that shit all the way out. <laughs> but anyway, um, so it shut down about 7 o'clock local time, which is mountain time where I'm sitting at. And 
I, you know, I stop and everything, and I take a look and I check, and I'm like, well, the weather is getting kind of bad. And I've checked the website because I the day before I've been shut down, which messed up my whole schedule. And oh, you know, well, that, that road, part of the road shut down. Well, I may as well stop because if I get to the part where it's blocked off. Like, they're going to ticket me if I park on the road or on the side of the road or, you know. There's no real, unless you know what you're doing and you, you're you up on it and you're always up on it, you're not going to know where the hell everything's closed at to stop early enough to not get up on the shit because by the time you get up on it, it's too late. And any of the truck stops around in some of these places, they're already full. The whole ramp's full. The, the whole lot's full. Like, what do you do? So, it's a good thing I stopped early. So, it's like, oh, the weather's bad and everything. You know, the, that part of the road's closed. All right. So, I told my dispatch. All right. So, I'm sitting here. And I wake up a little early, so I double check it. It's still kind of closed off. And then... By the time they said to get a hold of them in the morning when everybody's in, you know, six in the morning over there, central, about five mountain time, I got up and I checked, and things are starting to kind of clear up. And I'm like, okay. I actually overslept a little bit. I didn't get a hold of them until about 6, 6.30. And I said, okay, everything's starting to clear up a little bit. Do you want me to take it? Are they going to take it now, or do you want to reschedule till the evening like how is this going to work and in waiting for them to get me back on that I hear over the CB because I did leave it on because I should have left it on I should even leave it on now but if that dude's still yakety yakking like he fucking was well, there's been a real bad wreck about 30 miles up the road from where I'm sitting and Everything's all blocked up and shut down because I heard five or six trucks and then somebody else said seven. I don't know how many. Apparently it was a bad wreck because later on they were saying they think some, you know, they think it was fatal for a few people. I hope not, but that's the nature of the beast. I mean, I, you know. I can't be the one to jump out there in front of every wreck and go, no, no, don't, you know, like, it's, it's, it's terrible if it was. So I've been sitting here. Well, I mean, actually it ain't even been. Well, it's been over 12 hours, 12 about 17 and a half hours, you know, been sitting here waiting. But by the time that one wreck happened and I'm waiting, like, okay, well, I got to wait for that to clear out and them to tow them guys out. I hear again, like there's another wreck and another wreck, like between me and the state line, there's like three wrecks. And I, I keep looking back and it's like, even where I have been is all wrecked up. Told my DM, I said, I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> not till this shit warms up and it's, you know. They get this clear, it gets warmed up, and, you know, I, I ain't going anywhere. I ain't wrecking this truck. I don't give a fuck what's in the back of it. I don't care if it's fucking Mary Queen of fucking Scots. She's got to get to the church on time to get married. If the road's bad, sorry, bitch, you ain't getting married. <laughs> you, you're going to have to wait till next week. So, now the one dude that was in front of me moved, and now some other dude moved. I mean, it's just, it's a clusterfuck here. I actually made it into a space in this truck stop. The guys that are kind of pulling in and like, oh, shit, everything's all closed. Let me find a place to park. They're just parking wherever the fuck they can, so... If I wanted to get out, I couldn't, but where the fuck would I go? <laughs> 20 miles down the road, if? 
Oh, sorry, you know, the gates are down, closed up. You're going to stop. Like, <laughs> where the fuck am I going to go? I figured I'd just go ahead and do this. And yes, I like the next to the last one, 10 minutes, and I've already been rambling. Well, since I've been uh, pretty much sequestered here and can't do nothing, and I know I can't do nothing, I've kind of had a little bit of a sauce. Oh, wait a minute. Where's the mic? I've kind of had a little bit of a sauce. I told everybody I shouldn't be, and I know I shouldn't be, and... I ain't going anywhere. I ain't going anywhere till fucking a good while. It may be another day before I fucking move. Y'all ain't getting me fucked up. As I said before, the wreck that's down there 20, 30 miles up the road, I hear, the last I heard, the traffic was backed up for six, seven miles. Everybody just in line waiting. The hell if I want to do that, you know, I'll be perfectly fucking honest with all y'all, straight up, and, you know, I would rather be stuck in a place, this is kind of the measure, I'd rather be stuck in a place where I know that if I feel like having a little bit of personal time, I can do it without being stuck in traffic and having to move three inches every fucking hour, you know? If I can just kind of lay back here and do what I want to fucking do, I'd rather do that than sit in traffic for eight hours, holding the steering wheel, cussing and fucking whatever, and looking at you motherfuckers doing stupid shit like trying to get up on the shoulder and trying to get up around people when ain't nobody going anywhere any fucking way. When everything does break loose, everybody's going to be hell-bent to get the fuck up out of there because they've been sitting there for four, six, eight fucking hours. <laughs> Increasing the likelihood that somebody will get in another fucking wreck. Damn it. Come on, you better finish burping or don't you? That's not good. All right. Eat shit, motherfucker. Come here. I knew you would do that. All right. Well, come on. Nah, fuck. Oh, that's right. Because I still had the turbo on for the fucking, the fight I was in. Come here, you motherfucker. There we go. Oh, looks like a crimbus tree. No, don't. Why did you do that? Come on, I need all the life I can get. Stop fucking with me over here.
Get the fuck out of here! Up and over, damn it. No. Second. No, don't. Why? Asshole dog. Oh no, bitch gone. Shit. Well, shit. Doesn't matter. I'm not uploading anything any damn way. And yet, it's still going to have a hard damn time. It's really a pitiful ass area to be in. Okay, so one D twenty. So I've already been to that one. Princess room. There's there's fucking there's one of them I miss. Probably just going to go ahead and all right. 
so let's see. That's the top of the shit. So that's the D20. That's that's the one I I've already been to that one, so Looks like I'm going to have to drop down here and... Oof. I ain't doing nothing but hurting the shit out of myself either. Yeah, I don't think that's it. No, it done been up there. Done been to that one. Uh, yeah, I've been to that other one too. So. One. It was W seven in this area, which was that room there. Oh, come on now, where the hell is the last? Okay, the last lies with the three-headed dragon. So, where the fuck is the three-headed dragon? It's probably the same damn room down at the bottom where... Uh, I mean, that could be it.
I know that ain't it. There we go. So I miss talking a lot of shit like that last room or whatever. But I don't know where the hell the damn three-headed dragon room is. There's Chalice, right alcove, right tower, palace D1. Go to T1 to get the third crown jewel. Go to T4 in the bottom right. Which has a large gate and four slots. Go to the top of the area. Change the line three. Shoot the dragon's heads? Well, this is going somewhere. Oh, shit. Holy motherfuck. All right.
This might actually end up being the finale. Holy fuck. I might not even bother with trying to do any cleanup. I mean, I got some other games of shit I want to play, so... Oh, come on now. I mean, when the bitch won't even stay on the fucking platform. Son of a bitch. Well, just jump right off of there. See, look at that shit. Fuck a duck. I still wonder if that even... Yeah, that's, that that ain't working. <laughs>
I mean, I guess I'll get there in the end. Come on, get him. Holy sheep shit. Don't respawn. Here we go. Let's see where we're at. You know, I'm, I'm just going to go ahead and... I don't know, should I? I shit on it. Oh, I'm stuck in here. Okay, I'm, yeah, I'm stuck in here. Oh, yeah, I'm stuck in this bitch. Oh no. <laughs> this looks like a long hallway of doom. Ready? Mm. 
It's almost like it's taken me back to every room. That I needed to be in, you know, or that I needed to use this shit in. Well, I know one thing. No, you can't go in there? Can't go in there either. Let's save this some bitch. Mm, yummy. Wasn't I already here? Sounds like the music's getting faster. It's getting faster. Pied up, the city of Pied up. See, this is probably what's going to fucking do me in for sure.
So my first instinct is to go the opposite direction of where he's going. And yeah, it, it. he can't shoot nothing. Fuck. Yeah, he's still going to get me, yep. Which you know that ain't his fucking final form. Shit.
Oh, come on now. See, I'm not getting anywhere with his ass. If I could find a way to defend against those damn things. I wonder if
Yeah, I mean, it ain't getting me anywhere. Yeah, I might have to actually... <laughs> oh, fuck. The whole time... The whole time I had the goddamn game shit off. Fuck. Well, I mean, can't go back and fix it now. I mean, at least you could hear me in the commentary, but... Fuck. I, I do that quite often, so. So what I think I'm going to do is chop it off here. He said chop it off. <laughs> Don't say chop it off. <laughs> Don't say chop it off. I might run back and watch a video somewhere of somebody beating it to kind of see how they did it, but. Yeah, I mean. I expected to do a lot more in, in this one than just all of a sudden start facing the final boss, but I guess I'm here, so the next one should be the finale as long as I figure out how in the hell to beat this son of a bitch. Anyway, uh, let me go ahead and get out of here and do a thing, and I shall talk to you all later. This has been Conspicuously Incredible Gaming with your host, Mike. If you like this content, give it a thumbs up, like, subscribe, share with all your friends, do all the things. It really helps. Also, check the links down below for the places that I stream at when I do stream. Check the links below for the places that I'm going to archive at when I get a lot of them up and running. And there's a few of them. Uh, bit shoots up, but I don't think I've got it posted. Uh, other than that, uh, there's the Discord. If you like to hang out and whatever with us, with all the other shenanigans... There's uh, Streamlabs if you'd like to donate a dollar or two, and if not, that's fine. I just appreciate the view. You know, everything's everything. So that being said, thank you all for watching. Take care, and have a good four. Conspicuously Incredible Gaming is a Conspicuously Incredible production. Conspicuouslyincredible.com